Good morning. I know. I I'm being a bit naughty. Look, I'm making myself another coffee. Right, I just need to show you this. If anyone lives in Perth and you like coffee, Humblebee, they roast their own. This is amazing. There it is. Uh, Isla Bombay. Bomba. And it's white nectarine, red grapes and mandarin. It is delicious. And I had, I don't drink coffee very often, but I had a taste of this and it's so delicious. I went and bought two more bags. Anyway, I'm just checking in to say hello. It's me. I'm, I was, I'm trying to find ways to make this a lot simpler for me so that I can post more regularly. And um, I've just found a new software. I have been editing the carnival lasagna recipe for like eight weeks now. Having said that, I've had a go at it three times. It's taken me several hours. My, I use InShot to video edit and it has given me trouble twice. And so then yesterday, I spent nearly all day in between doing other things, editing this video. And again, I've ended up saving versions of it and because it starts stuttering and doing all sorts of weird things. Anyway, so today I'm having another go at it using Premiere Rush and I think it's working. And I think I could find a quicker, easier way to upload more frequent videos because the ones I was doing took me an, a couple of hours each day and I just don't have that sort of time at the moment. And I just need it to feel easier so that I can do it, you know, so it doesn't feel overwhelming. So anyway, this morning I've had a bite of chicken. Um, I don't really love the garlic. Paul marinated it last night and it's, um, he marinated it with a bit of garlic, which I, haven't had garlic for a couple of years now. I, I sort of stopped it a few, a couple of years ago, garlic and onions. So I have it very rarely. I do have it sometimes, but just I have it rarely. Um, I'm sitting here next to the coffee machine. You see there, uh, the kettle. <laughs> Boiling myself some water to make myself another delicious coffee. Um, yes, yeah, so he marinated some extra chicken for me and I cooked it in the air fryer the Ninja Foodie Grill, yes, you know. Um, I've been having a little bit of dairy. This is what happens to me when I have dairy, besides a few other symptoms. Um, and so I had a piece of that this morning anyway, because it's cooked and I'm gonna eat it. Uh, <laughs> um, I don't wanna waste it. I might give it to Paul, he'll love it. He just loves garlic, <laughs> he just loves garlic. Um, anyway, so I'm thinking to myself, I've got I've got some hanger steak. I've got some rib cap, loving rib cap, right? Rump, rump cap, sorry. Rib, rib caps, a whole nother story. I bought that, it was a disaster. Um, I still made the best of it though. I turned it into crunchy beef, but uh, rump cap, I just got some oven, brisk, oven baked brisket out to defrost. And I've got one other, oh, of course, porterhouse steak, which is New York strip. Mm -mm. So I'm going to have one of those three things. I boiled up 12 eggs yesterday, so I've got heaps of boiled eggs in the fridge. But I will let you know at lunchtime or what I'm having because it's, I don't know what time, I think it's about 10 in the morning, 10, 10.30. So I'm, I'm editing right now. Editing, let's see how long editing this lasagna recipe ends up taking me. I reckon I'm going to spend six to eight hours. I know that, that is a crazy, silly amount of time, but it's just been... A, pa a, a melody of errors. I don't. What is that word? What is that saying? It just has been crazy trying to edit this. Almost last night, I almost said to myself, "Let's scrap it. All the footage I've got, and just make a new one, which won't be for a while, because you know, I, I make these recipes up based on what I'm eating." Anyway, so this morning I thought I'm going to give it one last bash at getting it sorted. So let's hope. You will hear the story as we go on. Yes, I'm holding the phone, and so it's a little uh, wonky. All right, I'll see you soon. So it's lunchtime, and I will show you what I'm having. A boiled egg and some brisket. Oh, let me, let me turn the camera around. It is nearly three o'clock in the afternoon. 
but still, it's lunch and maybe half of dinner. Hello. Well, it's night time. I ate at about two. I didn't really feel like eating, haven't really felt like eating, but the husband brought home a treat, a meat treat. Loving these meat treats. Um, he brought me home two burgers from Hungry Jack's, not Hungry Jack's, uh, Macca's, two of the Angus beef patties. So I thought that was a lovely treat. So I'm actually right now, The you can hear the air fryer is on. It's actually cooking three slices of bacon. Uh, in a couple of minutes, like literally three minutes, I will go and put the two burger patties, a slice of cheese and the bacon on top. So I'm gonna have bacon cheeseburger for dinner. So just wanted to tell you that, I will show you that in just a tick. Um, and today I found um, one of my, what do you call it? It's, it's getting late and I'm getting tired. I've been editing the carnival lasagna video all day in between doing a few other things. Oh my gosh. I finally found a piece of software that could cope with the many videos that I took. I was speeding it up, slowing it down. Look at my hair, it's just everywhere. Speeding it up, slowing it down, you know, putting in comments. I have edited and made this video three times, three times. It's a lot of work, this particular video, because I think I was really tired that day and I took so many videos instead of just doing like two or three shots. Anyway, so I am feeling a little bit brain tired today, but I got it done. I got it done. I got it exported. I got it uploaded. Finished, finito, it is done, all right. But anyway, um, I was um, in my studio looking for a few things and I found an electrolyte sachet and I thought, why not have it? So this is, I made up an electrolyte. Let me see, you can't really see. Oh, it's nearly finished, can you see? Can you see? So this one, bought these a while ago now. Hydration Up is the brand, this is Citrus. Tropical fruit, tropical fruit. And it's nice, it's very light. This is a very big cup, so they're normally made for smaller, a smaller portion of water, but it's just ice and water in there. So this is over a litre and it's delicious. So I'm gonna go and see to my bacon cheeseburger and then I will show it to you. Mmm. So, here it is. Now, that isn't teeth marks, that is the tongs. The mark of the tongs, you can see there. <laughs> it's too hot for teeth marks. So, that is three slices of bacon. And that bacon is like the $12.99 bacon. So it's the really, really cheap one. But, the only reason it's cheaper is because there's a it's not there's the streaky part and then there's the loin the pork loin and it's very lean and round so what i do is i cut across it and really when i'm like today when i'm just not interested in the loin i cut actually that loin portion off leave it in the bag because i do use it i cut it up into small strips for um, quiches and omelettes and, and to flavour something with bacon. It's very good, nothing wrong with it. Um, but when I have bacon, I just want the streaky bacon. But it's $20 a kilo. The, the, the cheapest streaky bacon is 20 bucks a kilo. So can't always get that. So get the other one, which has the streaky part and then it has the loin. Anyway, so this is the other burger patty, which I decided I didn't, I didn't want it. So I'll keep that for tomorrow, but this will be just plenty for me. Burger patty with some cheese and what? Three portions of bacon. So all I'm gonna do is, I, I like to keep a few pieces to eat with my meal. Look at that bacon, it's hot, ouch, it's hot. I oh, know you can't. Can you see? I will show you. Let me just cut a bite for you. Oh, yeah. And my hair's sticking up everywhere. Alrighty. Um, actually, let me see. 
I don't know if I can do this. Let me see if I can move the um, camera around. Yeah, it's so, hello, it's so, it's so far down, right? Oh, I might have that bit and that bit. Just move that over a bit. That's the spare one. Don't worry about that. But look at this deliciousness. And I make sure these can be dry when you, let me show you, when you reheat them, they can be dry. So what I do is I add tallow now. I've sort of learnt how to have them. I'm just going to, I'm going to put that in a baggie. I won't leave it like that. So there it is. Delicious dinner. Mmm. Yum. Mmm. So, that's me. That's dinner today. I am going to go now. Rest my weary brain. Actually, I've got some work to do. <laughs> um... For my other channels so i'm gonna do that finish my electrolytes fill it up with water and then i'll be ready to go tomorrow how you doing how you going are you doing anything right now have you got a carnivore challenge on or keto vore challenge or low carb or are you just looking for some inspiration for carnivore it's an amazing low inflammation diet and it's amazingly reduces all the noise in your brain where food's concerned well it certainly has for me a lot of people say this but i'll just speak for myself i took all of that food noise away from me and i don't have any cravings after the first i don't know when exactly it was week or two i'd have to look back on my vlogs to see when i started talking about noticing that i wasn't having cravings anymore excuse me um, it's amazing in so many ways. It's not, you know, it doesn't make you superhuman. It's not, you know, it's not the solution for everything because I don't know, some people think that it, it's like perfection. But it is the best way of eating I've been on ever. So I love it. Anyway, I'm going to go and eat my dinner. Yes, here it is. And it's getting cold. So I'm going to go and eat that. Well, as much of it as I can finish. I'm going to take a dairy pill <laughs> because I'm a little rebellious like that. And I will see you in the next one. I'm not promising. I'm not saying I'm going to do daily vlogs. I would love to, but I just don't know if I can make that happen. But I'm, cer I'm certainly wanting. I'm feeling like vlogging more. So I will see you. Me and my hair that sticks up everywhere. We will see you soon. <laughs> Sending you love. Bye.